Let's go into my room. Hell, let's go in there. It's gonna be cool. Let me show you my room. Can I sit down? <laughs> Serotonin right in my blood. Yo, it's me, Matt. My muscle is a quirked up fat boy who's just goading with the sauce. So, this is Grapple Dog, uh, who's also goaded with the sauce, I believe. And this is a brand new indie game. Now, I know February is stacked with big AAA releases. Don't forget the indies, they need love too. And Grapple Dog needs it the most, just because he's so cute. I played a demo of this a couple months ago, and I fell in love with it. It's super fun. Uh, big ups to Joseph, the main dev behind this game, for for getting this out there. Um, I'm really excited to play the full game uh, for y'all out there. You will fall in love with this dog of grapple like I have. You know, a little jet setty. I, I admire that already off the bat. Please, give me more jet set radio style music all the time. Hundreds of years ago, the people of Partash lived in hunger and hardship. Hey, it's like the world today. Then one day, the great inventor appeared. Using his genius intellect, he built wonderful devices to help the people. I'm sure that's a tax write-off for him. In turn, those who lived in Partash came to adore him like a king. Ever since then, treasure hunters have searched far and wide for the inventor's devices. Some hope for riches, some for glory, but all hope to take part in Battle Arena Toshinden. Sorry, just really reminded me of Battle Arena Toshinden. I know that happens a lot. Look how cozy this is already. Just that small little light source off that boat. Love this already. This was not, this whole story sequence is new to me. It was not in the demo from what I remember. There's our grapple dog. And, and... Grappling hook bunny. Cat? I wasn't sure what that was. Already like, like the, I feel more emotions over this than any AAA game I've played recently. <laughs> oh my god. That's, that's, that's a broken prostibural protuberance right there. Oh, I forgot that he talks in little barks. Ouch, what happened? Intrude our alert, say your reasons for trespassing. This is the only way you can talk as a robot. I don't make the rules. Engaging laser beam attack. Don't you run for a lot of time from a laser. Zap, kapow, blammo. Ha, ah, don't worry about it, fella. I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm just pulling your dick. After a thousand years stuck down here, I needed a laugh. Wait, we're stuck down here? My friends are probably worried sick. Whoa, calm down, fella. It's not the end of the world. Not yet, anyway. How about you follow me? That's 2023. Uh, how about you follow me and I get us both out of here? That'd be great. Thanks, Wolf. Awesome. So yeah, look at, look at, okay, that's his dash. That's fine. He does that automatically after walking for a bit. He has a little slide, which is cool. I don't have to double tap for that. That's fine. Look at this jump. The bounding enthusiasm of this jump. It's so good. What else you got for me, tutorial? Yeah, I'm just gonna wall jump just because we know that by now. There's a thing like that. I mean, that's that's what it is. Like, like Grapple Dog, does he even need the grapple at this point? He could just be called Jump Dog. Like, I'm glad the grapple's in there. I I love it. But just just Jump Dog. And just use the butt slam as you are wont to do. If I was to have a special move in real life, I'm going with butt slam. The applications are limitless. Liam would support me in that. I butt slammed him once. You got a name, fella. What's a doggy like you doing in a place like this? I'm Grapple Dog. No, his name is Pablo, which is perfect. We were looking for some kind of treasure, something made by the great inventor. I don't know why I say it like that. The professor can explain a lot better. I wasn't really listening. Treasure, you say? Well, today's your lucky day, Pablo. You see that big chest over there? It's got something in it you gotta use to get us out of here. God, I hope it's a gun. Gun dog. I opened it myself, but I haven't got the uh, right tools. Tools, you mean like a screwdriver? No, more like a pause. I don't got no pause. Good point. I guess I'll open it then. By the way, since you asked for mine, what's your name? Well, I've used my name in a long, long time. Not since before I was trapped uh, down here, but I guess you can call me Null. Jeez, from Metal Gear. Oof. The perfect soldier. It's nice to meet you, Null. Now let's get this chest open. Let's do that. Where's this chest? Oh, oh. oh it's right. It, this is the chest. Holy shit. 
grappling into the background. Oh, this is this is gonna be an epic loot, or it's just it's just the grapple. But the grapple is epic. My namesake. So if you're a character called Grapple Dog, and when someone finally invents a grapple, you're probably like, oh shit, it's all coming together. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I can I can dance. I can laugh. I can swing. Look at that. So you can only go on the the different colored blocks. Do you recall that from the demo? You can't just grapple e everything. That would be that would be ludicrous. Super fun already. I mean, when you're in any type of a platformer game, either 3D or 2D, uh, you just know uh, just by moving the controller. Just in, in, in like after the first 30 seconds, you're like, "Yep, that was good. That feel real good." X gonna give it to you right there. Okay, fella, now we've got to open this big door here. Use that Grapple Explorer and try to find the switch. I don't know. That big X door is giving me do not open vibes. Pablo, you're going to have to trust me on this. We need to open this door. Guess I can't handle his little barks. Can't. So fortunately, that's there. Oh, he has idle animations. Zoom in on that, please. The head bounce. Good. What else you got? He's got a second head bounce. A third one. Will there be a... F <gasps> and he looks he, he looks there. He's always looking over his shoulder, Grapple Dog. Because everyone has a lust for the grapple. People want it, you know? And I, I don't blame them. Can I want to, like, do a cool thing? Can I even do the cool thing? I can't. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is the cool thing. Yeah. Ah, sick. Yes. <laughs> yes. No, what is this place? What are you doing? Oh, Pablo, well, I mean, I gotta sit over here. Oh, okay, don't me. And then I'll form the head. Oh, Pablo, you have no idea what you've done. <laughs> Get cut to the Metal Gear Solid Revengeance music. After all this time, I'm restored to my full power. Now I'm free, free to search for the cosmic gadgets once again. All thanks to you, fella. If you want my advice, run. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's a very relatable uh, animation there. Just keep holding down to run. I will. I will. I will grapple only when needed. So yeah, this this bit also wasn't in the demo. Holy! Hmm. It was just a couple of rooms, and uh, this cutscene was definitely not here. What? No, my Pablo. Please be okay. It's like the the, the Imperium of Man just did what. Uh, the Annihilate Light, the Annihilatrix. What is it with Terminatus? They did the Terminatus. Finally, I can finish what I started. Holy shit, this is our villain. Everything will burn. <laughs> did you expect the line, everything will burn in a game called Grapple Dog? I did. We, we already lived it. We don't need to go through it. Oh, he's warm again. That's good. I want him to be warm. And then I jumped in the water to get away. And then I woke up and you asked me what happened. <laughs> And then I don't know what happens next, because that's now. <laughs> Follow focus. You gotta. You get. You say that you obtain some sort of grappling device. Show it to me immediately, so I can steal it. Right here. It's a power up. Whoa, well, cool. The aerodynamics are incredible. Forget, forget Arrow Watson. This is a creation of the great inventor. It's a priceless artifact. I must have it for my book on the inventor. Professor Null said something. Professor, sorry, Professor. Null said something about the cosmic gadgets. Yes, that raises a few questions. What does Null hope to achieve by gathering them, I wonder? I just, I don't know. Create, like, some type of robot utopia? A robot hell? Perhaps he's a hedonism bot? Trying to remember my research on the subject. You know the great inventor scattered the cosmic gadgets, but none knows... I always say this, none. I don't like no one spelled with like that together. With the two O's? No, I don't, I don't. I don't believe in that spelling. I know any of you out there, you know that's the correct spelling. I'm like, ha, I'll have to just take your word for it because I'm not gonna take your word for it. You put a space between no and one, Joseph. <laughs> there are theories that you could uh, power an enormous machine, or wake a monster, or contact space aliens. Can we do all three? Regardless, we know uh, that when gathered, they will release enough energy to damage the fabric of reality. Bring forth an old god. Let's do it. Is that bad? 
I love Grapp- I love Pablo. The amount of energy would destroy the entire world. What? I like he has like a little superhero costume. You have to get the cosmic gadget, stop Null, and save the world. Fuck yeah. I'm with you, Pablo. I hope whatever you need. I don't know what you do yet. What's, what is your name, even? Pablo, we're more historical researchers than world savers. Ah. Uh, ah, so. If there's no world when you finish your book, then nobody will be there to read it. That's a good point. It is a fair point. All right, I suppose I'll come with you then. Great, let's go. First you need doggy treats. And this is your open world! Or open map, I should say. You know what I mean. Mario Brothers 3 thing. It's so cool. It's so... Like, the game could just be this, and I'd be fine with that. This cool little 3D boat. I think it's 3D. Voxels? I don't know what it is. Can't go to... Just, I... Like, I like how they're kind of accessible. They're just kind of grayed out. We could just bomb them right now. Do we have bombs? Wait, why are you here? Oh, I need 30, of course, to destroy this awful, awful robot. Oh, I will. Can I go now? No, he hates it. He hates it. I got... Before, before he crushes me. Uh, let's go grapple some things. Let's collect some shit. And let's take on that boss. What is your favorite collectible in the game? I think Fruit's High up there. I like my Yoshi games. As those, these butt boxes. Look at that. Just... Oh! Huh. Trying to remember what was in the demo and what was in terms of mechanics. I think it was all there unless a new stuff has been added. I don't... No. God, the music. You know what it actually reminds me of specifically? It reminds me of uh, Sonic Rush. Which is a good fucking thing. And just... I, I mean, he's got a hard head. That's why I guess he survived that huge tumble that I was really concerned with at first. Of oh, this checkpoint. Oh, satisfying. And confetti too. What the hell are you? I don't trust goats, I'm gonna be honest. Hey, have you seen an evil robot around here? Well there, buddy, evils are... <laughs> All right, have you seen uh, just <laughs> any kind of robot? Yeah, sure, there's a bunch of horrible scary robots up this way. Nice, nice, I can't wait for that. Well, let's get some, let's get some more grapples going on. Oh, I need to grapple way better than that. But I want to collect the fruits too. There's there's a lot to unpack here, in all honesty. I mean, so I think I saw like uh, gifs of this game on Twitter one day, and it just said grapple dock, and I, I said, yep. And I was like, that's the video game. I I will check this out when released. Here I am. I can't stop with this soundtrack. I am I am living it. I'm loving life right now. Alright, there's you. What do you got for me? Weird... Uh, Kareen? I forget your name. As uh, Pablo, I want to tell you about this purple gem over here. Oh, is it the sort of thing I shouldn't touch? Like the toaster? No, though you really need to stop doing that. According to my research, these gems were used by the great inventor to override robotic signals. Perhaps if we were to collect enough, we could clear the way to further islands. Apparently there are five hidden in each stage, so make sure to look for them. Thank you. Can I just kill you, robot head? Which I feel a little weird about, considering... <laughs> Considering Null is just a robot head, so I don't know what that that's implying, if anything. I should be able to uh, wall run up there. Okay, so since I have the carrot, let's go back. Let's see if that guy lusts after the carrot. If he, I, I don't know what, what his deal is exactly, but we'll see what it's going to be. Oh, there you go. I have the carrot, sir. What are you going to do for me? That's right. Do the only thing your head was designed for. It's probably designed this way to make me jump, make me think there's something there. It's not like an invisible, no. Okay. I'm satisfied, actually. You've convinced me there's nothing there. There better not be anything there. He's my bunny friend. They're gonna tell me about that blue whatever it is. Okay, I just want to do that for fun. <laughs> so what she says. Um, hey, Tony. Okay, it's Tony. Well, what are you doing there? Oh, hey, Pablo. It's nice to see you. I just, I, ju I just saw you. I'm using my analyzer to study this strange object. According to my readings, it's wirelessly connected to a network of localized teleportation devices. As long as it's not an NFT, I'm fine. I'm not following. Collect this coin and you'll unlock a bonus level on the overworld. Neat, huh? That is neat. I love collecting shiny things. He is a dog. I literally have a thing, a tool that should stop that from happening. Ah, ah, ah. So close. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oof. Almost barely clear. Ow, my head. Oh my god, look at this end of end of level thing. What do we Yeah Very satisfying. How'd we do? 
all the gems. Both tiers of fruits. So, everyone, there's a pet button in Grapple Talk. I'm gonna press the pet button now. I didn't press it again. I believe you can only pet when you've gotten like the maximum amount of rewards. I was missing like three pieces of fruit. God damn it. All right, so we're gonna murderize everything on this island now. Probably has its own little gimmick. And the bonus level, damn, okay. Kind of intimidating, but I'm sure we can do it. Hey, I was in the middle of driving the boat, but that's okay. Did you know that after you beat a stage, you can play it again in time trial mode? If you get really good time, you'll get a gold medal. Oh, wow, that's neat. Uh, do I have to do them if I want to save the world? Nah, something tells you the time trials are just for fun. Good to know. I mean, that one robot has to see what's going on there, right? The one that's left that's like not getting killed. He has to see me stomping on his friends and playing with the bolts inside. And that can't be fun for, I don't think that's cool for Grapple Dog to do. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Do you want to open that up? Cause it has the gems. Oh shit. Okay, there it is. I'm going back. Why did I not grapple? It's the first that's in the damn title. Okay, there it is. Get this fruit first. Okay, 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 where's the goat? Hit the switch, that's good. Get in you. Shoot me out, where's that goat? Oh! Can I not? No, I can't. Okay, fine, fair enough. Hey, oh, okay. There you are! Yeah, eat that shit. Oh my god, I missed you right in the middle. Oh, uh, we're good. I'm happy with that. Maybe I might go back and do some more on that, just that one level. I don't get to pet him though! Mm, big Yoshi's Island vibes. Uh, when you go to those underground stages where it has all the sparkly, like, stone. That's what I get from here. See, the thing about underwater has only happened so often because grapple completely useless there. So what, you know? Why, why, why? Why would we have to mess with that? This jump arc just gets me over, but not too much. Just don't, can't get too comfortable with it. Let's go inside Grapple Dog's little gra grapple boat. There's a whole thing here. Oh my God, okay. Do you give me like upgrades? That'd be awesome. Hey, Tony, how are you doing? Oh, hey, Pablo, I'm just checking out the engine, making sure everything's running smoothly. Oh, cool, well, it looks like the big spinny thing is spinning just fine. Yeah, the drive gear is operating correctly. Hmm, it seems that there's coolant exposure from a blasted radiator vent or a malformed conduit bracket. Tony, I'll be honest with you, I don't know what the fuck you say. Uh, okay, the engine's too hot, so I have to cool it down. I understood that. Good luck with whatever it is. Thanks, good luck with all the jumping and swinging around and stuff. All right, thank you. Uh, so this door was accessible. That was a Game Boy. Boomerang Bandit press. I, I love playing video games in my video game. I gotta sa save the seven crystal babies before I get stuck in deep didgeridoo. Oh, I have a gun too. I didn't even notice. Oh, how did I game over? <laughs> I realized I had the gun. <laughs> Jesus. Give me that belt. Yeah. I died there. I didn't grapple away. I just jumped into nothing. How do we do? Okay, that's fine. We got that, and we Did I just, I need one more coin. A gem. I need one more cold, cold dew blood gem. We're gonna get that last cold dew blood gem up here in bonus level number two. Go! It's not going so well. <laughs> and I'm in literal hell, oh no. Oh, come on. Come on, yeah, give it to me. That's all we needed. We're gonna destroy this Tengen Toppen Gurnlagen that's sort of guarding the entire world. No, I finally found you. Pablo, you made it all the way here. You're looking a lot less dead than I expected. No thanks to you, you tricked me and then almost blew me up. Oh yeah, that was fun. Whatever, I'm here and I'm gonna stop you getting the cosmic gadgets. Ah, so you've been doing your research. I'm too busy to deal with you fella now, but you play with Rex instead. Metal Gear, Rex. Can we move? Do we want to avoid this, whatever he's doing? I mean, it's gotta be the big robot we were theming towards, right? Yeah, that's a Rex. I'm assuming we're running here. 
Like, we're grapple dogging away from him, and then we're gonna have a little showdown. Oh god, that's so fast! Oh! Now he's gonna be extinct again, this robot dinosaur. Like, Pablo doesn't even care. Is he his face there? He's like, I've done this before. I've been around the block. It's one of the cosmic gadgets. It's a telephone. Okay. <laughs> oh, I missed one gem from that entire stage. Oh, we got another. Uh, we didn't get to pet him again, but that's okay. Oof, that was a lot of sweaty, sweaty platforming. Pa Pablo, I fitted the boat with a turbo drive. Give you additional thrust. That's how science. I'm sorry, I don't know what science. You now travel quickly to worlds you've already visited. I don't even need fast travel. I'm grapple dog. Oh, so it's just like I'm in this zone and you're like, uh, bam. Go to Merry Mountains or Sunny Shores. There you go. Just go 20 feet that way and I have fast traveled. I do like that the water is a different color here. This is Grapple Dog. It kicks ass. If you're interested in a platformer um, this month, I highly, highly suggest this because it's because it's automatically fun. I think I think I've made that evident. Uh, thanks, Joseph, for even making this game, and thanks to his PR company for sending this code my way. But I had this, you know, like sort of wish listed, and I was gonna buy this on Steam. But you know, that's the full disclosure there. I just more platformers like this, please, that are just wholesome and cute and also just really, really fun off the bat. Any other indie games like this you'd like me to try on the channel, let me know and I'll see what I can do for you grapple dogs.